Hey guys, I do myself here. Welcome back to the channel. Big day today for Apple releasing iOS 13.6 to everyone worldwide every device that supports ios 13 can now update to ios 13.6 now this software has been installed on all of these devices for nearly over a week now and i've had time to test the software i also have a full breakdown of everything that's new links will be in the description for that video 13.6 brings additional improvements to the apple news plus subscription also digital car keys is new with apple carplay as well some improvements to the health application in new settings of with 13.6 as well so if you want to watch that video links will be in the description as i mentioned now apple today also released watch os 6.2.8 as well alongside 13.6 and for those that do not run ios 13 or those devices that are not capable of running ios 13 apple also released ios 12.4.8 with additional security improvements and patches as well this is always nice to see but in this video we're going to be comparing the battery of ios 13.6 official final version versus ios 14. now as i mentioned ios 13.6 the gold master copy has been installed on these devices for a little over a week so i had time to test the battery thoroughly and in this video we're going to have a full breakdown and comparing all of these devices that you see here now i wanted to break this down into two separate videos touch id devices then i'll do face id devices if you guys want to see that video as well now the only touch id device that's not present here or was not tested was the second generation se but everything else from iphone se first gen all the way up to iphone 8 plus was tested now before we take a look at some of the results now keep in mind these devices they were all running brightness on the display to 70 percent i used siri to set every brightness to 70 percent I also made sure that Bluetooth and Wi-Fi was enabled. I listened to music, browsed the web, did some activities on the iPhone. Both tests were identical pretty much on iOS 13.6 versus iOS 14. Brightness, settings, tasks, all, everything was the same to test the battery. Now, in terms of battery health, these devices have anywhere from 70 to 95 battery health, depending on the age of the device going from the iPhone SE, of course, being the oldest, all the way up to the iPhone 8 Plus, it ranges from 70 all the way to 95. So average use and the average wear of the battery. So let's go ahead and take a look at the results for the battery test on iOS 13.6 versus iOS 14. Now what you're looking at here is from left to right the iPhone SE first generation, the iPhone 6S, 6S Plus, iPhone 7, 7 Plus, iPhone 8, and 8 Plus. Again, that's from left to right. So on iOS 13.6, the first device to die was the iPhone 6S Plus, surprisingly, followed by the iPhone SE, then followed by the iPhone 7, followed then later by the iPhone 7 Plus, iPhone 8, iPhone 6S and the champion was the iPhone 8 Plus and then we jumped over to iOS 14 of course. Now the results were a little bit different on iOS 14. iOS 13.6 outperformed iOS 14 and that's to be expected but let's take a look here. The iPhone uh, SE first generation had 5 hours and 33 minutes but it was not the first device to die. The first device to die was actually the iPhone 6S Plus once again with 5 hours. Then followed by the iPhone SE as I mentioned coming in second. Then the third one was the iPhone 7. The fourth one was the iPhone 7 Plus. Then the fifth was the iPhone 8. The iPhone 6S on position number 6 with iOS 14 so outperforming all of those devices and last but not least the iPhone 8 Plus outperforming every single device on both iOS 13.6 and iOS 14 alike. So here's the breakdown taking a look here at the graph. We see that on iOS 13.6 the iPhone SE first generation had approximately 40 minutes of extra on-screen time on 13.6 versus iOS 14. The 6S was identical on both tests. Again, same task, same settings, and everything performed identical on these devices. The iPhone 6S Plus was about an hour plus on 13.6, so extra hour on 13.6 versus iOS 14, followed by the iPhone 7 with 45 minutes or so of extra on-screen time, then the iPhone 7 Plus with 35, the iPhone 8 with 30, and the iPhone 8 Plus 
with 20 minutes everything was plus with 13.6 versus ios 14 excluding the iphone 6s which was identical so all in all the performance of the battery on these devices on 13.6 is excellent as you can see here outperforming ios 14 keep in mind ios 14 is running still in beta but the uh, performance seems to be very very good so far for ios 13.6 let me know if you want to see face id devices thank you for watching today's video and i'll see you real soon Peace.